This video will explain how to split a lot. Swing an item allows you to split a lot into multiple tags. The item is referred to as a lot because it's a collection of like items that have been posted in EIS with a single tag number, but with the number of items field greater than one. Splitting the lot can be done in item screen using this option here, or using the split feature in EIS screen. In splitting a lot, you will be prompted for the tag number to split. Next, enter the beginning new tag number to generate. Most districts use the original tag number as the beginning new number. The remaining tag numbers will be generated sequentially. The number of new tag numbers to generate prompts you to enter the number of new tag numbers you wish to split this item into. You may leave this field blank to default to the number of items on the lot and press accept. Once you hit that, a second screen will display the split items allowing you to enter a serial number, a model number, the organizational unit, and allow you to enter in the location for each printer. I'm going to go ahead and modify these to where they're located. Once you are finished, you press your, the process key to process the split. It will generate a split tag.txt file listing the original tag numbers and the new tags generated from the split. You need to exit out of the program in order to view this text file. 